The music news for the streets, the music news for your beats, the news for the music stuff that you gonna need. We gon' talk about plugins, we gon' talk about gear. If it's news on this music, we gon' talk about it here. Let's go. Welcome to the music news for the streets. I'm your anchor man. Some, some, some. Hit the keys. And in today's newscast, we have all kinds of exciting stories from five freebies. Looks like SoftTube just dropped a new controller. I've got some deals for you guys, but before we get to our top story today, I wanna let you guys know, mm, this may not be the best newscast because I did not get to go in depth on everything. If you watched the live stream today, which will have been yesterday at the time when this video comes out, you'll know that my computer was giving me the blue screen of death. Um, so I spent most of the day trying to get my computer to work so that I could shoot this video. So I do have some good tools for you guys, but I didn't get to go really in depth into these tools. So I'm gonna get to show you a little bit about them, but I can't show you everything. So let's get to our top story. Our top story is a freebie for you guys. It's called Flight. Uh, when you open up Flight, it's going to look like this. Um, so this is a Rompler. It's pretty cool. Um, basically, you get some controls over here over some macros. You don't really get to get underneath the hood in this thing, but there are a bunch of presets. Um, there is a free version and there is a paid version. So we're gonna go ahead and mess with the, the free version. But if we come over here, um, you know what I'm saying? This is how you get underneath the hood. You have to pay for the whole thing. So let's go ahead and push continue real quick. And it's in trial mode. We're not gonna really mess with it because it's in trial mode, um, but you can mess with it while it's in trial mode and check it out and get the rock with it. We're just gonna mess with it in the play mode though. Um, and then boom, it's telling me my, my trial's already ended. So you only get to try it one time. So I just wanted to show you guys that. I didn't, I did, I was not aware of that. But I made a little loop with this thing real quick because I wanted to hear what it sounded like. All the melodic sounds come from this and the bass comes from this too. Um, it's not all the way mixed down, but it sounds like this. All right, so that's the little loop I put together. Let's go ahead and listen to a few of the presets. Um, so in this thing, so this is the first preset that I used in this bad boy. Um, and it just sounds like this. So with this though, you can turn on the note sequencer. So boom, you turn on the note sequencer and it's gonna sound like this. So again, since this is the free version, you don't get control over the sequencer, I do not believe. Um, but you can come down here and you can mess with some of the macros. So let's go ahead and check out some of these macros real quick. All right, and then let's go ahead and check out a few more of the presets real quick. So right, right here, you'll see these are all the presets that you're gonna get in this bad boy. So you do get a whole bunch of different presets in here. You're gonna get sequences, um, you're gonna get bases, you're gonna get keys, you're gonna get a bunch of stuff. We'll just go to the keys first since I have kind of like a little key melody set up and we can hear what some of these different keys sound like. Let me see something. That's kind of what that's gonna sound like. We'll listen to a few more of the keys real quick. It says the best of keys. I'll be the judge of that. Let's see what this sounds like. <laughs> they ain't lie, I think that's what I used in my stuff too. I uh, got super saw or soft saw right here. Let's see what this sounds like.
We've got, uh, did I play this lo-fi piano layer right here? And you'll notice each one of these has different uh, macros down here that you can control. So all the macros aren't gonna be the same for each sound that you use. So that's fire that you can mess with that layer right there. Let's go ahead and go to um, the second sound that I use. So the second sound that I use was this right here. And it just sounds like this. It was like a little synth. So let's go ahead and make this hop up an octave real quick. So let's go ahead and go back to the right pattern. Shift C, control up. Let's check out some more of these synth sounds real quick, just so you can kind of hear what some of them sound like. All right, so let's see what this Jupiter sounds like. So we'll listen to a few more of the, the, the synths real quick. So then the next sound that I used in this beat was this one right here, and it was a sequence. All right, so there is a bunch of sequences in this thing as well too. So, you know what I'm saying? Let's just go ahead and play another one at random. That one might be an octave too low. So, I mean, you got some cool stuff in here. You do get some basses too. I'll play just a couple of basses for you guys too as well. And so then the last thing I used it on was this bass right here and the bass sounded like this. All right, so let's listen to a couple more real quick. All right, so let me go ahead and go up an octave on this bass as we listen to these real quick. Shift C, control up. All right, so let's listen to it now. Let's listen to a couple more at random real quick. Listen to this layered. So in my opinion, this isn't a bad freebie. Um, again, it is a little bit CPU intensive, um, but it's cool, it's all right. You know what I'm saying? The sounds in it do sound really clean. They sound really good. I guess the person who put together this plugin has been putting together sounds for a long time. And he's got a huge library of sounds and he just decided to give this one away free for us. So go ahead and go check this one out. All right, guys. And the second free plugin that I have for you guys today is a drum processor and it is called Break Shaper. Uh, when you open up Break Shaper, it is going to look like this. So it's got a pretty basic looking GUI, but it's got a filter on there. You've got resonance, mod rate control. You've got a tilt EQ. You can add dirt, harmonics. You can squash the sound, and then you can add transients. Um, so this is just something that you can throw on your drum bus and change the way your drums sound. 
Um, so I'm just gonna push play. You're gonna hear what the drums sound like, and then I'm gonna turn on Break Shaker, and you're gonna hear exactly uh, what it sounds like. So this is what it sounds like without Break Shaper. So you can hear how it gave it that crunchy sound right off the back. Um, you can mess with the tilt EQ if you want. Um, you also have control over your filter right here. You have a few different filter pa uh, types. So you have low pass, high pass, and band pass filter right there. And that allows you actually to hear the resonance and the moderate here a little bit more. And then you can keep messing with it so you can turn the squash up if you want to. You also have control over your transients. Yo, that one's kind of fire to me. So um, we'll just listen to uh, one more real quick. So that's another freebie you guys can check out if you need something for your drums to change up the way that they sound. Maybe if you want them to punch a little bit more, maybe if you want them to sound a little bit crunchier, maybe if you don't have anything to parallel process your drums with, you can download this, check it out. It's pretty lightweight and see if it's something that you like. And the third story I have for you guys today is the third freebie that I have for you guys today. I need to say something too. In these videos, not everything is always free. I let you guys know what's free. Sometimes you guys be messaging me like, oh, this plugin wasn't free. Well, I didn't say that one was free, but this one is free. So it's called Bandbrite and it's free tape. So this is basically a tape emulation. It does sound pretty cool though, because you get tube saturation, you get this tape, how much tape you want to add. I'm not really sure what this sweeten does, um, but you also have dust, flutter, slam, low, and high. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just play the melody for you guys real quick, and then I'm gonna turn this on and you're going to hear what it does to the melody. So uh, here we go. So it's pretty cool. Um, you get control over dust, flutter, slam. Uh, you get to boost the low end and then you can boost the high end or you can take away from the high end and then you can add tube, tape, sweeten. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys hear what it sounds like as I take away some of the dust and add it back, the flutter, all that stuff. So you can hear it adding that extra little bit of color there, that little, that little, that little dustiness sound. Let's go ahead and push play so you can hear flutter. So that's pretty cool. You can do a lot with that. Um, and then again, you got uh, tube and tape down here. And then you have oversampling up here. I'm not gonna mess with the oversampling because uh, I guess I'll hit it a couple times for y'all. We'll see.
And then I'll just let you guys hear what that sounds like on some drums too, because I know a lot of people like to put tape on drums. So let's go ahead and put this on the drums real quick so you guys can hear what it sounds like. Um, so let's go ahead and hit skip. This is what the drum sounded like again. All right, so now once we turn it on though, um, we can get it to sound like. And then we can just boost the drums as much as we want. We can add some more tape and tube to that. And so as you can see, you can completely change the drums. You can completely change your melodies. I think this is a pretty solid tool. I'd recommend this one. I know there's a lot of tape emulations out there and tape plugins, but a lot of them sound different and a lot of them color your sound a little bit different. I like the way this is when color sounds. I would recommend it for show, for show, for show. And up next, I've got a few deals for you guys today. These deals come from Zounds. You guys already know I love me some Zounds. If you don't know what Zounds is, it's a great place for you to get gear, especially if you're low on funds, you might be able to get the gear you want without any credit check, as long as you set up payment plans and give me your information. So the first deal I have for you guys today is this Universal Audio Apollo Twin X Duo. It is currently $100 off. So if you've been looking at uh, a Heritage Twin X Duo, um, you can grab this one right now for $100 off and you'll get a few plugins with this one. Um, so the plugins that you will get will be the UA 1176 collection, the LA 2A uh, collection, the pass, the Pultic Passive EQ, the UA 610 2 preamp EQ collection, and the UA Pure Plate Reverb. Uh, not a bad deal. And this one you can get with no credit check, just six payments of $149.83. I'm up next. I can't afford this one, but I thought I'd bring it to the channel because I know this is a very solid synthesizer. So the Oberheim OBX, you can get the desktop analyzed synthesizer right now for $700 off and you can get the one with the keyboard for $1,000 off. So if you know, you know, very solid uh, synthesizer, something that's on my dream list. One day I'm going to get one of these, just not today. Uh, the last deal I have for you guys from Zounds, our Cali Audio is offering some deals on their monitors. So if you needed some monitors right now, um, you can check out the Cali Audio WS62 Dual Active uh, Subwoofer. It's $50 off. Um, you can get the Cali Audio LP UNF powered audio monitors for $50 off a piece. Um, and then you can get the Cali Audio WS12 V2 powered studio PA subwoofer for $120 off. Um, so that's a very, very solid deal. And you can get all of these without a credit check. So just something to take a look at. And up next, it looks like SoftTube has just come out with a brand new console, mixing console. Let's go ahead and take a look here at the story. Um, so right here, as you see, the SoftTube Console 1 Fader Mark III is a doll control Starship Enterprise, a professional touch sensitive fader controller. Let's take a look at this thing in all its glory. Look at it, it does look beautiful. I'm not even gonna hold you. As you see here, it's got LED screens at the top of each fader, which is pretty solid. This thing actually looks pretty nice. I wouldn't mind getting my hand on it and testing it out. Um, let's take a look at the story a little bit more though. So the SoftTube console one fader Mark III is a new ultra responsive DAW fader controller with haptic feedback and high resolution displays. I know that White Sea Studio did a review on this today and he said that it works in reason. And he said, that's the reason why he doesn't have a controller like this, but apparently this is supposed to work in every DAW very well. With the channel Mark III, the Fader Mark III forms SoftTube's Console 1 mixing system, a comprehensive control system for DAW operations and plug-in control. SoftTube Console 1 Fader Mark III. Like the Mark I, there are still 10 faders, but the Mark III introduces some swanky new technology in the form of analog fill. The touch-sensitive faders have 0 0.02 millimeters resolution and haptic feedback, giving you the most console-like experience possible. Furthermore, each fader, you'll find a high res screen that provides a complete channel overview with metering for quick DAW setups. There are four basic operating modes, a console one, Pro Tools HUI, generic MCU, and Apollo Central. 
In addition, the Fader Mark III offers direct Cubase and Logic integration and control mappings for Ableton, Studio One, Luna, SampleTube, Reaper, Bitwig, Mixbus, FL Studio, and Cakewalk. Man, I don't like y'all having FL Studio so low on this list. I mean, why is FL Studio behind Mixbus, Bitwig, SampleTube, Luna? Come on, man. S studio, come on, man. Show FL Studio, so put some respect on our name. On our name. Uh, what's exciting is that the dual USB-C ports, you can now daisy chain up to four units for an extensive control solution. The controls are more complete than ever with access to six sends per channel. So again, this thing looks pretty fire. Uh, meanwhile, they are mounting options so that you can join forces with the channel Mark III for an ultimate DAW control solution. Overall, the console one system is impressive and provides some healthy competition for SSL DAW controllers. So uh, this thing is 999 MSRP uh, over at Toman. I don't know if they have it anywhere else, but I'll leave it linked below in the description. All right, guys, up next, I've got two more freebies for you guys today. Uh, they are both for contact, but they are for the full version of contact. They're pretty solid. Um, the first one is called Bamboo Flute, Expressive World Flute. So this is only gonna be limited or free for a limited time along with the second one as well. This thing is pretty solid though for a flute. Um, it's only got one preset, but it allows you to change the expressions of the actual flute. You got some effects under the hood so you can spread out the sound, put it in stereo, add a little bit of reverb. Um, again, I haven't really got to mess with all this stuff because my computer wasn't working. It's like 1.45 in the morning right now. Um, so obviously I wasn't gonna get to test all this stuff out too deep. Um, but on this, this is what uh, some of the sounds sound like. Pretty solid, but you can come over here and you can change um, just the way that the flute sounds. Um, so like, here's another, here's another one. listen to another one check out this overblowing right here So let's go ahead and check out a few more just so you guys can kind of hear what they sound like. So we got some expressive longs right here and these sound like. Pretty solid. Uh, let's check out this one right here. Popping with this one right here. So, I mean, you guys get the gist of that one. Pretty solid flute. Um, you know what I'm saying? Go ahead and get that one if you need a flute. All right, guys, the last freebie I have for you guys today comes from Rigid Audio. Shout out to Rigid Audio for giving us all these freebies as of lately. Uh, this one's called Interference. Uh, so Interference is basically a drum plugin. Um, so you can sequence stuff, you can add atmospheres, all kinds of stuff to the sequencer, and then you push a button down. So that's pretty cool. And you can add things to the sequence. So you can make the sequence however you want. Uh, depending on the number you have here, it's gonna change the sound. So 
So that's pretty cool. You get a ton of presets in this thing though. So as you see here, you're, this is just the lo-fi category. Uh, so let's just go ahead and listen to this one. Um, so let's go ahead and add a couple of kicks up in here. That's pretty fire. So I'm saying you can get some fire grooves with this thing for real. Let's go ahead and listen to another one. Takes just one second to load. But you can just add stuff wherever. Obviously that didn't sound great because I just threw it in there. But you got these atmosphere ones that are cool too. So let's go ahead and check out a couple of these. That would be perfect for scoring something. Uh, just a bunch of dope stuff in here. I mean, you can randomize stuff. So you can make it sound different. Let's go ahead and let, let this load up real quick. You know, you can randomize this. Let's check out a few of these big drums real quick. Let's see what And as you see here, you can change the rotation so you can make it come around every other time or something like that. Solid uh, drum on the runway. Let's see what this bad boy sounds like real quick. You've got electronic. Let's hear what some of these sound like. So just all kinds of different grooves that you can use. So that's pretty solid. You also get edit options under here. Let's go ahead and go back to a lo-fi one real quick. Cause I kind of like these lo-fi ones. I think they sound pretty dope. Um, let's find one with some drums in it though. And we'll just add some drums. Here we go. Then you have options underneath the hood. So you've got like this disturb function. You can add a sub if you want to. I'm not familiar with how to get all this to work properly. I know that a sub can play in here though. But you have control. Just pretty solid. Another one I'd recommend checking out, especially if you need something that's got some grooves, it'll definitely get the job done for you, as you can tell. All right, guys, and the last thing that I have for you guys today is just a few more deals. Uh, these deals come from Plugin Boutique. Let's go ahead and check them out. Uh, so the first deal that I have for you guys today is a flash sale on the Waves Platinum Bundle. If you're familiar with this bundle, I believe it's normally $325 on sale at Waves. You have to enter in this code if you want to get it. It is only $99 currently, which is a phenomenal deal for a Waves Platinum Bundle. But make sure you enter in this PB Plat Bundle because when you come here, it's going to say something stupid like $19.99 or not. Nobody's paying. No, no, there is nobody on earth that's paying that for this Waves Bundle. Maybe in 2005, but not today. Um, so this bundle is going to come with a whole bunch. Um, I don't know if they show everything in here. Yeah, they do. 
Um, so it's going to come with a ton of different plugins. I think this comes with like 50 or 60 plugins. But as you see here, you're going to get all this stuff like this, you know, C4 multiband compressor is solid. Uh, this drum channel is solid. This electric piano is solid. I mean, a lot of this stuff solid. I'm not going to go through everything and tell you what's solid. I know this GTR is solid. If you don't have a guitar amp simulation, I used to use this all the time. H comp is fire. H delay is fire. You get all the ultra maximizers or fire. I mean, you just get a lot of stuff with this um, bundle. You know what I'm saying? As you see, I'm scrolling through, you get 60 total plugins. Um, very good, very, very good deal. Um, if you're looking at wave stuff and you're looking at one of these bundles, uh, the next deal I have for you guys today is plugin boutiques, $49 synth month bundle. So in this bundle, um, you get like 10 different synthesizers. You're going to get wave oscillator. This is a plugin boutique, um, plugin that was created by them. Um, you're also going to get this quadra, uh, which is pretty solid. Um, you're going to get collective. I've never heard of this. Um, you know what I'm saying? So I can't tell you if it's solid or not. Um, I know that you get mini bit. You also get super eight, which is fire in this bundle. In my personal opinion from native instruments, um, you're also going to get euphoria by you which is pretty solid. I've done a review on this on my channel. So you can check that out. If you want to hear what that sounds like, um, you're going to get ultra analog session. You're going to get bliss Omega synth, which is pretty dope. Even though it looks like doo doo, it's still pretty, pretty solid. Um, you're going to get ask box. I'm not really sure what that is. To be honest with you, quadrant two is pretty solid by glitch machines. Um, and that's it. You know what I'm saying? So if you're looking for a bunch of different synthesizers for cheap, um, you know what I'm saying? This might be the deal for you. And I guess that's what I got for you guys today. Hopefully I can help you guys out with some of these freebies. I know there are some solid ones out there. I would definitely recommend checking out that flight. I'm um, checking out all those contact libraries. If you can check out that tape machine, cause it's pretty solid too. Uh, but make sure if you guys do like this content though, you drop a whole elbow on that like button, hit subscribe and that notification bell. So every time we bring you guys a new video, you can be the first to see. Signing off as your anchor man, some, 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 hit the keys. Until next time, peace. Some, 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 hit the keys.